A new hope for hepatitis B patients. Beperoversin sodium by brought by GSK for hepatitis B patients. GSK developing a new product for hepatitis B patients as Beperoversin sodium, according to global data. Who is GSK? GSK is mainly a British multinational pharmaceutical and biotechnology a global healthcare company. GSK focuses on developing, manufacturing and commercializing general medicines, specialty medicines and vaccines. In which sectors GSK do research? GSK offers drugs for the treatment of diseases such as HBV, HIV, respiratory, cancer, immunoinflammation, antiviral, central nervous system, CNS, metabolic, cardiovascular, and urogenital, antibacterial, dermatology and rare diseases. Beperoversin sodium phase 2 trial. Beperoversin sodium is under clinical development by GSK and currently in phase 2 going on for hepatitis B. What is the success rate of phase 2 trial? According to global data, phase 2 drugs for hepatitis B have a 36% phase transition success rate. PTSR, as of now. When Phase 3 trial will start, GSK have the target indication benchmark for progressing into Phase 3 shortly. What is Beperoversin sodium? The product named as Ionis HBVRXA combination of Isis HBVRX. ISIS GSK3RX is under development for treatment of chronic career patients with hepatitis B infection. How Beperoversin sodium will work? It is directed through subcutaneous injection. The drug candidate targets viral HBV mRNA and reduce the production of viral proteins associated with HBV infection, replication, and targets TLR8. What is TLR8? The full form of TLR8 is toll like receptor 8 agonist selgontolamod called SLGN, which modulates cytokine expression and effectors of adaptive immunity, has been reported as safe and well tolerated, inducing reductions in hepatitis B surface antigen and hepatitis B antigen levels in chronic hepatitis B patients. Target of Beperoversin sodium. The main target is the lymphocyte activation gene 3 protein A combination of protein FDC or CD223 or LAG3. A programmed cell death protein 1 A combination of PD1 or CD279 or PDCD1. Which platform followed to develop Beperoversin sodium? This is an antisense oligonucleotide developed based on antisense technology platform. What is antisense technology? Antisense DNA technology is a method to inhibit or down regulate the production of a target protein by using antisense DNA or RNA molecules. How antisense technology platform works? An antisense sequence is a DNA or RNA that is perfectly balancing to the target nucleotide sequence present in the liver cell. The mechanisms of antisense effect. There are two possible mechanisms for an antisense effect. One, the method that trusts on targeting of the mRNA is called the antisense strategy. Two, when the double-stranded DNA or genes situated in the nucleus are targeted, 
The approach is called the anti-gene strategy. Though hepatitis B is a double-stranded virus, in this situation nucleus method is targeted and that is followed to the anti-gene strategy. We hope that this news has brought a good message for you. We will continue to bring such videos in future shortly. If you like this video please like and share this video more and more. Please support our channel. Thanks for watching Great Wisdom Discover. We will meet you with new update in the next video. Thanks for watching Health Wisdom.